happened November 22nd in the lobby of the Elkhart Police Station. Behavior termed inappropriate between police department employees and a female visitor results in one firing, one resignation, and four suspensions. Today, the public gets its first peek at what all the fuss was about. Mark Peterson joins us with the surveillance camera pictures from the lobby. Mark? Well, you know, we've heard the incident involved uh, inappropriate touching and suggestive photographs, again, at a very public city-owned place, the lobby of the Elkhart Police Department. Now I've got a chance to see exactly what went on. It all started early Thanksgiving morning when a woman with dark hair, a white shirt, a denim miniskirt, and white boots entered the lobby of the Elkhart Police Department. The entire visit was recorded by two separate surveillance cameras, although there was no audio recorded. It's important to note that this woman was not under arrest. She was just waiting on transportation. I believe she resides in Chicago. So she was waiting on somebody to come pick her up. At one point, one of the men working the front desk appears to give the woman a drink. The friendly gestures weren't all so innocent. At about 4.04 a.m., the woman steps into a room to the side of the front desk. On the right of your screen, through the open door, you can see inappropriate touching and some apparent picture taking. At one point, it appears the woman's skirt is pulled up to her waist. Around 4.15 a.m., the woman climbs up onto the counter of the front desk, at least Two of the three males behind the desk appear to be taking pictures with camera phones. One even walks into the lobby to snap a picture from behind. As everybody played their little part, and it was just basically wrong all the way around. Was she in any way a victim? Or a... She was more, it was, she was more, part, she participated, so. The prosecutor has finished revealing the video while he concluded the conduct was unbecoming, inappropriate, and otherwise an embarrassment to the department. He did not find any of the conduct to be criminal, charges will not be filed, meaning this case is now closed. I'm happy to close this chapter and move on and get, get on with regular business. Uh, the police department did a good job in policing itself. We apologize that it happened, but it did happen, and it was dealt with, and we're moving on. Again, two of the parties involved don't work at the police department anymore. One was fired, one resigned, four others were suspended. Okay, Mark, why was she at the police department in the first place? You said she was waiting for a ride. Yeah, strange situation. Earlier, she was traveling down the tow road where the vehicle she was in uh, was stopped by the state police who arrested the driver for drunk driving. This woman uh, from the Chicago area simply had no ride home, was trying to arrange for one. Certainly an eye-opener. Yeah. Thanks, Mark.